Hey guys, oh my god, I feel like really sick. I just got home, like literally just walked in, so I thought I would do this right now while I'm still in my cosplay. So first of all, I'll just show you that, give a bit of an explanation. So basically, this is drawn on with eyeshadow, the mustache. Um, I'm Toki Wartooth from Metalocalypse. Very specific outfit. Um, if you don't get it, it would kind of involve a lot of explanation, but basically I'll try and find a picture and put it up on screen. If I put a picture up, I'm sure you'll get the idea. So, <sighs> Icon, if you don't know, is like this anime convention they have here, and I got some stuff. Not like a ton of stuff. I was actually, I wanted to buy more, honestly, but, um, you know, they didn't have them as much cool stuff this year, unfortunately. Well, this isn't really from Icon, this is from 7-Eleven, but I just threw it in here because I got around the same time. It's just this little collectible straw, little Psyduck. I don't know, I thought it was cute. My bedroom, as you can tell, is kind of shitty, so I'm trying to like get some things to decorate my room. And I thought like, I'm put this in a little like cup with my I don't know, makeup brushes or something, it'd be cute. So there is this little Psyduck. This is like the big thing I wanted, because I wanted a stuffy, and I'm actually a little disappointed they didn't have as many good ones, and a lot of them were pretty overpriced for what they were, but I did find this one which is really cute. It's this Pikachu with pink cheeks. And I probably wouldn't have got a Pikachu, like if I had my pick, I wanted to get like a Charmander or a Skitty or, um, um, I'm blanking right now, but there's other Pokemon that I would have got over Pikachu just because I already have a Pikachu and Pikachu's kind of like, you know, the standard, but, you know, um, this is the best one they had. They had a Jigglypuff, it was way too expensive, it was like $40. It's just like, uh, no way. And this one is just really cute. Um, they had another one that was similar. It was a girl Pikachu. It had a little bow and it had the round tail, but I didn't, it, its head was like turned all the way this way and I, it, it didn't look right. Oh, they had a really cute Torchic too. But it was, it was just too much. It was like only this big and it was like $35. It was like, Ridiculous. And I'm just noticing now he has like a zipper on his ass and I don't know what... Oh my god, is this reversible? Okay, I didn't even know what I was buying. Is this re... Okay, it turns into a ditto? Okay, this is cool. I didn't even realize that. Okay, that's... that's epic. They had a Charmander that did that too, but he had like the ditto face, and this one doesn't have the ditto face, but that's kind of also cool because, although I don't know if I'd really do that because if you flip him, wouldn't that kind of wreck, like, the ears would get squished and stuff? I don't know if you could really do it. They had, um, little Pikachus with flower crowns, which were super cute, but they were way too much. They were, like, the same price as this, and it was, like, half the size. And plus, I'm pretty sure I saw those on Wish, and I could just get it off there if I really wanted it. Okay, I look so ridiculous with this mustache, but I love it. It's a great, it's a great cosplay. Like, what can you do? Like, this is just a really good cosplay. If you knew Metalocalypse, it would be, I think, instantly recognizable. There was one girl who did know what I was, and she was like, Oh my god, are you Toki Wartooth and Going Down Clock? Which is the name of the episode. I'm like, yeah. Um, and then I got some stickers from one of the artists there, Charmander. Charmander, when I was into Pokemon, when I was in kindergarten, which is really when I was into it, um, specifically that one year, uh, Charmander was by far my favorite. Uh, first of all, because he's really cute. And second of all, because he was orange, and my favorite color was always orange. And I think that's a big reason why Charmander was my favorite. I think when I was actually a little kid, I really liked Sailor Moon, 
Sailor Mercury and Sailor Jupiter, but as I got a little bit older, my favorite became Sailor Venus, and she is also orange. Maybe that has something to do with it, I don't know. But that's just a cute little sticker of her transformation wand. Oh, of course, we got a little Pikachu, because you gotta have a Pikachu. Although, I actually was gonna get a different one, but all they had was like Togepi and a couple other ones that weren't like so much the cute Pokemon, and obviously you want like the cute Pokemon. It's like, well, might as well get Pikachu, you know? He's fucking market tested, he works, people like him, there's a reason, he's a good design in the show. And I forget what this one is actually called, but there you go. It's like, it goes like actually right there. But yeah, so that's really cute. So I'm definitely gonna figure out something to do with all the stickers I have accumulated. Oh, there's my pass. They, they ran out of the little paper or the plastic things they slide in and the, they just put them on these strings, which don't look great. All, every other year they give you an actual lanyard. I don't know if they just ran out or what. I took some pictures in my cosplay at the convention, and I don't know if they're going to be on Instagram before or after this video comes out, but the string kind of looks like headphones in those pictures, and I was like, oh shit. I didn't notice till after. But anyways, the last thing I got, they have to always have like tons of Japanese snacks, and I don't usually get them, but I thought this was really cute because it's got a really cute bottle, if you just look at it. Um, get maybe focus on that yeah like it's a really cute bottle so even when this is empty like that's just a really cute bottle to keep let's see if we can i don't know if you need it oh it is a twist open so let's see maybe if we just try it a little see if it's good it smells like really peachy like it smells like fuzzy peaches it's kind of crazy how strong of peaches it smells I mean, that's what it's like. It's literally like drinking fuzzy peaches. That's really what it tastes like. The bottle's really pretty though. I wonder how much fucking sugar is in this thing. Where's the sugar? 9.9 .9 .9 grams. It's hella cute, I know that. Oh, you could use the Psyduck straw in it, I guess if you want it. <laughs> so yeah, that is my stuff. I got an icon. Pretty happy with it. I would have liked to, I mean, I saved up a bunch of money from a paycheck of mine and I totally would have just blown it all. I had about 200 bucks that I theoretically could have blown or at least 100 of it. And I did not. <laughs> I didn't even spend all the money I took out at the ATM. I took out, I think, $40 and I didn't even spend it all. So, you know, that's good. I'm saving money. But at the same time, I wanted to just like get a ton of shit. And I just didn't have like tons of cool stuff. And it's not just anime stuff. Like there's been plenty of years where they have like lots of stuff that isn't necessarily anime. They have like anything to do with like animation or just pop culture they have all that stuff there they had these spice girls barbies i almost bought one but the boxes were super wrecked like they were not in good condition and they didn't have if they had ginger or baby i would have bought it but they only had scary sporty and posh and i might have got the posh one but her hair even though she was in the box her hair was totally fucked and the Sporty Spice one had something on her teeth. Like, she's, like, smiling like that, and there's, like, some mark on her teeth. So that was kind of disappointing. But, yeah, they always have, like, they have a lot of cool, like, fan artists there, and they do not just anime stuff. Like, there was a lot of South Park stuff, Steven Universe. I'm not really into it, but, like, anything like that is going to be there. And I found some pretty cool stuff there other years, and this year is just kind of lacking, even with what I was kind of searching for, which was like, just 
What I really wanted was a big Pokemon plush, and I did get one, and he is really cute and soft, and I did not know he could turn into Ditto, which is pretty cool, but I would have preferred maybe a Torchic or a um, Charmander or like a Squirtle or Skitty or, or somebody else, even like a Litten or, or something, but... You know, just good old Pikachu. How many stuffed Pikachus can you possibly have in your life? But hey, you know, should we... Mm, I almost want to try and get, get him into the Ditto, but... Uh, I really feel like I'll wreck it. Because, like... If you... It's just... It's stuffed with, like, stuffing, you know? I feel like other ones that are reversible, like that, you stuff him in there, and I really don't know how you would stuff this guy in here, like, how, how, would his head go, I don't, I think, honestly, I think you really can't, I think it would just wreck it, because I just can't see how you're gonna get that big ass head in that little sack of a ditto, but he cute either way. So yeah, that is my haul, I don't know if you guys like this kind of stuff, I know most of my viewers are male, but um, I know a lot of males are weebs, so maybe you guys like this one. I'll see you guys in the future at some point. <laughs> Subscribe to my main channel as well. I do live streams there every single Saturday, and if there's not a live stream on Saturday, then there's an actual video, and I do, like, actual, like, good videos on that channel, like video essays and videos about YouTube and videos about movies and videos about, like, stuff like that, so.